students my name is sumit mehta so in this lecture we will discuss some question based on magnification formula and mirror formula okay so let me first write the question for you so students here is the question given to us which states that a convex mirror okay so it is a convex mirror which is used in rear view of automobiles has a radius of curvature of 3 meter okay so the r is given to us as 3 meter and we know the relation between the focal length and the r is f is equals to r by 2 which will be 3 by 2 which is 1.5 meter okay students now it is given to us that if a bus if a bus is located at 5 meter from the mirror okay so the u is given to us that the bus is located here so it is on the left hand side from the pole so we will take the sign of the bus as minus 5 meter okay so directly we will use the formula 1 by b plus 1 by u equal 1 by f so 1 by b plus 1 by minus 5 equal 1 by 1.5 okay so what we will get 1 by b equal 1 by 1.5 plus 1 by 5 so we will get the value of v as 1.15 meter so the image will be formed on the right hand side okay at a distance of 1.15 meter so it will be formed here okay and the magnification now we have to check the magnification so the formula for magnification is minus v by u okay so the minus v by u by using the formula minus 1.15 upon u is negative minus 5 so what we will get is it is 0.23 so the size of the image is 0.23 times the size of the object okay now what is the nature the image will be virtual and direct because in case of the convex mirror the image is always formed to be in case of convex mirror it is always virtual and direct image is formed and the size of the object is point size of the image is object size okay size of image so this is what we have to find out okay so now discuss the another question based on same formula let me write the question for students so students here is the second question which states that an object of size 4 cm is placed at 25 cm in front of the concave mirror so the mirror given to us here is concave mirror of focal length f is so this distance is 15 cm and the object is placed somewhat between focal length and the center of curvature okay so let's say it is here a b okay at what distance from the mirror should the screen be placed in order to obtain a sharp image so now i will first i will check the u is negative 15 sorry 25 cm okay h is given to us as 4 cm we have to find out the u and f is given to us minus 50 cm so we will use the mirror formula directly 1 by b plus 1 by u equal 1 by f so we have to find out the image this will be minus 1 by 15 minus 1 by minus 25 so this will be my minus plus 1 by 25 so from here we are getting the value of v coming out to be Negative thirty-seven point five centimeter means the image will be formed here beyond C. Okay. 
okay now we have to check the magnification so it is minus v by u now we know the value of v and u is also known to us minus 25 centimeter so it is minus 3 by 2 so it will be so the magnification factor here is negative negative this will be 3 by 2 or you can say that minus 1.5 centimeter so the height of the image image height will be negative 1.5 times the height of object it will be minus 6 centimeters means negative means on the lower side and the size of the object will be size of the image will be larger than the object size so you can say that the image is inverted and enlarged in size so students now i hope that you are pretty clear about how to solve the question based on mirror formula and the magnification formula okay so in the next lecture we will start refraction of light okay so stay tuned for the next lecture on refraction of light and if you have still any question or any doubt based on reflection of light or any spherical mirror or any question that we have discussed in this lecture then please do comment in the comment section students i will be happy to help you guys there thank you happy learning